Hello everyone, this video uh, is about hearing screening in infants or newborn hearing screening also called as the autoacoustic emissions or OAE. So let me answer a few questions about this test. What is it? How is it done? When it is done? Why is it done? And how is it done? Okay, so first question is what is this test? So this test is like a hearing screening, meaning we know whether the child hears or not. So we just do a gross checking of whether the child can hear or not. How do we do this test? We have an instrument which looks something like this. We put this probe in the child's ear and through this probe we give sounds to the ear and if the cells that are responsible for hearing perceive the sound, they pass the vibrations back into a microphone in this probe and that is recorded as a response. Okay. Okay, and it's a painless, extremely reliable, quick test, takes less than a minute per year and all we need is a quiet sleeping baby or we can do it when the child is feeding, but we cannot do this test when the children are restless or are crying. So this is about the test. When is this test done? We do this test during your first visit to the OP. So after discharge from the hospital, during your first visit to the doctor, that is when this test is done. So we can do this in infants as young as four or five days old. Okay. So next comes the question of why do we need to do this test? Okay. So let me answer this question. The incidence of hearing loss in India is only about five to six per thousand. So when it is just five to six per thousand. Why is it that we say all the children need to undergo this test? A couple of reasons. First reason is hearing is the most basic faculty that is necessary for speech. So when our babies are born, what is it that we most look forward to? What is the most anticipated event for us is to hear their voice, is to hear them call out to us. So if the speech milestones have to be acquired on time if the child is expected to say a first word you know by their first birthday the main prerequisite for that is a good sense of hearing even a partial hearing loss during the formative years can be a big impediment in learning to speak so uh, essential for good speech is good hearing so this is one reason why we do it next reason is Hearing is a sense that, you know, if we have a hearing loss, it is not discovered very easily. Parents realize it as late as sometimes even three years. That's when they say the child is not yet speaking, is using a lot of signs, not responding. So is it, uh, you know, hearing that is not okay. So by then it is too late because with um, the current technology and, you know, advances that are available, we can uh, detect a hearing loss very, very early in a child, say even by one, one and a half months. And it is very crucial that we start whatever is the process necessary to remedy this hearing loss by as early as six months of age. So the quicker we start, the more we are ensured of a better future for this child. Mm -hmm.